in the heat of summer, we have sold a little Christmas troll. Space, the final frontier. Well, hello, and welcome back to my office. If you are a regular in these parts, if you are new here, my name is Nick, and I sell stuff on the internet. Here's the stuff. Do you want a tour of the office? Haven't done that for a while. Yes, yeah, so that's what I do. This is my job, and I run this channel with my wife. We sell stuff for profit. That's our job. And it is a Monday again. I know, I know I say it every week, but where are the weeks going? It's madness. It's a Monday. And generally what I do on the Monday is I share a bunch of orders with you. Today we've got, I think it's 35 orders I need to pick and pack and get out to their new owners. But I didn't get going particularly quickly today, so I need to really get a wiggle on now. So I thought I'd do something different. I thought we'd do speed picking. See how that goes. <laughs> so I'll uh, find a tripod, get you strapped in, and uh, we'll try that. Right, so there you are, perched atop your record box. Now, the first thing I need to pick is a private sale. Somebody got in touch with Andrea. In fact, it was... Karen. So thank you Karen. You got in touch and said you'd been looking at these on our shelf for a while and really fancied them. So you uh, got in touch with Andrea and did a deal. I'm not sure what the price was you agreed on but you have bought these, I can't point at them, mugs. These are very nice little Denby blue mugs and I think it's all three. I will double check with Andrea, but I'm pretty sure you bought the three. So those are going out to Karen. Thank you very much. So if I now open eBay, or if we, if we pan around this way, you can see empty shelves down the end. <laughs> okay. Right, don't fall off. So, eBay, let's have a look. Let's scroll to the bottom and start there. We've sold some Hornsey Saffron, right, hang on a minute. Can't forget speed, I'm gonna try and do this quickly. We're gonna crack through these. So, Hornsey Saffron Spice Jar set is, down here, three, and, Three more, six in the set. They have sold on offer for 15 pounds. I'm pretty sure we paid a pound for the lot. Next, we have a pink lusterware vase. That is this beauty. And that went again on offer, I think. Uh, at 20, so that's gone for 20. Look at that, that's quite a thing. <laughs> that's that. Speed, Nick, speed, remember. Um, genuine Vax uh, Type 6 replacement turbo pet brush. Okay, I did loads of uh, Hoover spares and stuff. They've been selling really well. I think it's that bundle. Yes, it is. Um, so yeah, just some Vax attachments. Um, they owe me nothing. In fact, when I went down to Carla's, she gave me a load of Hoover stuff that she didn't want to deal with. Um, I've sold pretty much all of it already. Um, this uh, is nine pounds all in when you include the postage. So not much value, but took no time to deal with. And they were a freebie, so happy days. Next is a clearance board game, which has gone. It is this one here. Um, I think it went on offer at like eight pounds or something, just to get it gone. We are in the business of clearing stock. If you've been following, shh, if you've been following the channel recently, you'll know we are trying to shift stuff. And this one had, you can see the uh, repair there, it had a ripped box, which I've repaired. So that's gone, good stuff. Next, Lego Lord of the Rings, uh, cabinet 16. Wait, couple of figures, which, oh, here, here they are. 
Can you see them? I need to keep reminding myself I'm doing this quickly. <laughs> Stop faffing about. <laughs> yeah, two figures uh, sold for £10. I've had these kicking around for ages. Uh, I didn't know who they were, but Google Image Search saved the day. Just snap a picture and search it with Google Image and it told me who they were. So £10 on those, pop those in that vase. Uh, we have a message. Hi Nick, I am a big fan of your YouTube videos and been a subscriber for three years. Hang on. For three years now. Please say, please say to Alfie, please say hi to Alfie for me. Thanks, Paul. Hi Alfie and thank you, Paul. Um, you have picked up ah, the second one of these uh, recipe sets which is loitering up here. So, yeah, thank you very much, Paul. This is a heavy beast. God, look at that. Hundreds of vintage 1960s recipes for you to have fun with. There you go, thank you for the order. Put that down there. Uh, next, 13 Rolling Stones records. Now, I've been through and listed loads and loads of seven inch records. Here they are, all of these. Um, some in bundles, some individually, and they have been selling like hotcakes. So, uh, stuff in the way. Uh, Rolling Stones, I think it's that bundle. Here, a bundle of Rolling Stones has gone for 30 pounds, and it's going internationally. So yeah, £30 on those. Right, next, Apple TV. Ah, that's finally gone. Um, somewhere in my rummage box here. Is that it? Yes. Apple TV. I grabbed this at a yard sale thing for 50 pence. Um, stay. And that has now gone for 20, was it? Yep, £20. Out the door. Next, Vintage Probus Metricook Wall Hanging Instant Imperial Metric Converter 1970s. That's the title. It's over there. Can you see it? Uh, that one. Now, we took an offer on this. It didn't have a great deal of value, but both Andrea and I loved this vintage, vintage bit of kitchen alia. Um, but yeah, uh, total when you include the shipping is £11, so we took an offer of £7.50 plus the post to get it moving. But yeah, very happy that that's going to its new owner. Hopefully that will be put up in a, in a retro style kitchen somewhere. Speed Nick, Speed, I'm supposed to be doing this quickly, I can't stop waffling, I'm such a waffler. <laughs> right. Um, Rosemary Connolly electric juicer. Ah, now this was uh, just clearance, needed it gone, and it's now gone. Can I pick it up one handed? Sure, I can. Yeah, 15 pounds just to get it moved. Let's pop it on the floor. No, actually, I can go in here. Sit there. Yep, just a juicer gone out the door. Excellent. Um, next, Kenwood Glass Liquidizer Blender Jug. Excellent. Um, parted out loads of Kenwood stuff. Here it is. And this is a vintage from a Kenwood chef, and it's the glass one. Um, I think this was, I think this might have gone on offer. £23. Um, yep, there's a market for this stuff. So that's gone. Find a home for that over there. Right, we're cracking through them, we're getting there. A uh, couple of Cliff Richard LPs I had kicking around. These went on a couple of days ago. Uh, yeah, I had a massive stack of Cliff stuff. Um, I did it, most of it in bundles and I had a couple of duplicates. Those were kicking about. Um, just popped those on for £10 plus post to get rid. Did the trick. Uh, more seven inch singles, Depeche Mode. I did a bundle of DM uh, seven inches. And yeah, got a pretty good price on these. 
Now I know my stuff when it comes to Depeche Mode uh, values and what to look for, etc. because I am a collector. I had a bunch of spares from my collecting and I made a bundle. They are all in there, I won't get them out. And these have gone at 50 pounds. Um, if they were in better condition, I could have got considerably more. Um, they weren't bad, but they all had some condition issues. Some had like stickers on or ripped where stickers had been taken off, etc. But yeah, very nice bundle, 50 pounds uh, sold on Buy It Now. We then have a duvet cover, listed a bunch of duvet covers. Uh, they've started selling. This one was nothing special. I, oh, I'm gonna make a mess if I try and do this one-handed. Hang on, have I got it? Oh, look, I've messed up the pile now. Um, yeah, this was nothing special, but it was a freebie. It doesn't owe us anything. Um, it is pink flamingos and that's gone for 10 pounds. And next, more Depeche Mode. We have a uh, CD single, and it's here. Now, I had, um, I had this in my collection, and then a very kind viewer sent me over a much better condition one, and I sold off the spare I had. This is behind the wheel. And this is sold for £12, very nice. Uh, Gilbert and Sullivan himself, vinyl LP, has gone for £12.49. The Bee Gees, the best of LP, has gone for £10. Let's quickly grab those. I've had this Bee Gees one knocking around forever. Can you see? Yes. Um, uh, can't find it though. Hang on a minute, where's that gone? Here it is. BG's best, yeah, that's been listed for months and months. Finally got rid and picked up a load of LPs and some were brand new sealed. And actually modern reissues. But they did, none of them really held a great deal of value, even being brand new sealed. This Gilbert, and Su Gilbert O'Sullivan, for example, uh, has gone at 12.50. That may have been an offer we had in, I can't remember. So more vinyl, out the door. Like so, how are we doing? We're getting there. Uh, more Depeche Mode, I did a pair uh, of Policy of Truth and I Feel You for 10 pounds. Let's quickly find those as well. Uh, right, here we go. Not that one, it's these. So. I Feel You, the only seven inch to be issued in the UK from Songs of Faith and Devotion. And Policy of Truth, nice little pairing, gone for 10. Next, we've sold, oh, we've got a note. Thanks, Nick, regular viewer, says um, Leanne. Uh, so thank you very much. Oh, it's an audiobook, The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. Um, now, where it is is another question. Uh, hmm. It's right at the bottom. Um, right, hold that thought. Right, I have retrieved it from the bottom of the heap. So, there we are CD, audiobook. Thank you very much, Leanne. For the purchase, we really appreciate it. We'll get that off to you today. So next, we have uh, some clearance media. Frozen one and two is sold for four pounds. Just to get them out the door, move that troll. Here we go. Very little DVDs left, really. I did list a few during this challenge, but I don't think I've got anything else left in stock to list now far as DVDs go. Frozen 1 and 2, go on. Um, now we're getting into media that I listed uh, last week. We've sold Pink Floyd, The Endless River, The Trogs, oh that's a 7 inch, The Trogs 7 inch single, 
ABBA Greatest Hits CD and DVD special. So we'll find those. Pink Floyd, Pink Floyd Trogs, ABBA. Got it? Pink Floyd Trogs, ABBA. Uh, Pink Floyd is here. Now, I had this on and I was listening to it, um, thinking I was probably going to keep it, but didn't do it for me. Really didn't do it for me. So, um, we sold that. I'll find out how much for in a second. ABBA. ABBA. Where are you? ABBA. ABBA. ABBA Gold always sells. This uh, was the special edition with DVD. And the Trogs. There it is, right at the back. This one. So, let's find out what we actually got on these. Uh, Pink Floyd, five pounds. ABBA, five pounds. The Trogs, eight pounds. This is Trogs Tops. It's like a mini EP compilation. Gone out the door. <sighs> wow, it's hot in here. Right, next. Peter Pan Playthings Wiggly Worms Manual. That's the instructions for a little kid's game. Osprey Kids Full Length Wetsuit and an Ellie Fun dressing up outfit. How random can you get? <laughs> so Ellie Fun is up here. That's been kicking around for ages. I let it go on a low offer just to get it out of the house. <laughs> so that's gone. Um, the last of the wetsuits, I listed three wetsuits. I'll show you that in a sec. What's the other thing? Oh yeah. Um, I saw this earlier, it's tucked in here. So I parted out a Wiggly Worms game and one of the parts I parted out was the instructions. So it's a piece of paper and that's gone out the door for three pounds. Uh, yeah, I had three wetsuits that I hadn't been dealing with forever. Um, this is a kid's, I think it's roughly si uh, age eight, nine. A uh, decent brand, Osprey. I think this was on at 30 and I took an offer at 24, something like that. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, 23.99. It was either an offer or, yeah, it must have been. So that's gone. Uh, right, moving on. Oh, I sold one of the glow bugs. Uh, Play School Butterfly. Now I talked about these in a recent video. Now it's one of these two. I went for 15 pounds each on these this time. Um, I've got to get the right one because although these are exactly the same, one is Hasbro and one is Play School. And I've sold the Play School. And I can't read it. Right, I'm going to bring both across. I'm going to need a magnifying glass. Even with these bins on, I can't read it. Can I read it over here? Is the light better? Not really. Anyway, one of these, the Play School version, is going out and that's sold for 15. I will check which one later. Uh, do you play Disney Cars Jeff Corvette? Yes, a car called Jeff has sold. Um, I cleared loads and loads of Duplo ages ago. This has been sticking around. It went on offer in the end for uh, six pounds. Uh, there you go, that is Jeff the Corvette. <laughs> uh, we have sold two official uh, Mario Kart wheels, the Wii wheels. I normally save these up to go with Mario Kart. But in this bid to clear everything, I just made a listing of two. And it wasn't too bad. I mean, it's only £9. That's free shipping, though. Um, but, yeah, not too bad, because you can pick these up relatively easily. But usually I save them up and do, like, two, three, or even four with a Mario Kart game. But anyway, those have gone. Uh, what have we got? Oh, a Dyson. Now, I mentioned when we went to Carla's, she, she wanted to get shot of a load of stuff she didn't want to deal with. <laughs> I turned up, she's like, Nick, have my stuff. 
So included in that was a Dyson with issues. Um, I'll show you the issue. It's got a hole in it. You can stick your finger in here. Um, anyway, this has sold for £20. Sold with issues. Pretty major issues. So that's gone. Um, oh, that troll I keep moving about has a message on it. Right, it says... Thank you for the offer, Nick, stroke Andrea. Can't wait to display this at Christmas. Love watching your videos. Uh, take care, Th Samantha. So thank you so much, Samantha. This little guy will be on its way to you. He is very cute. So in the, in the heat of summer, we have sold a little Christmas troll. Okay, next we've sold official Minecraft duvet cover on offer, I think it was, at 17. Whew. It's hot. Is that one gone? Um, we've sold a vintage camping gas lantern. And a job lot of 60s 7 inch singles. Camping gas lantern. Now I bought this along with a little burner. But when I came to list it, I realised the burner had some major issues. The base, um, where it has like little lugs that lock it into place, those had snapped off. So the base wasn't staying in which made it unsafe because it wouldn't have kept the canister locked in place. So um, that went and I just sold the lantern on its own. Camping gas lantern. Uh, and we got £16 for that. So let's grab these records. So the rest of the records I had that weren't worth doing individually or... Oh no, it's not there, it's here. That weren't worth doing a bundle by artist or doing individually I just did a job like I can't do that one-handed wait there a moment I'll go and get them stay yes yeah, so this is everything else um, there's some interesting stuff in here but nothing that was worth me taking the time to pull out and do individually four pennies there's uh, Fleetwood Mac and um, some interesting stuff it's a nice collection if you're into that sort of stuff and that's gone on offer at 27 just to get it moved and then we did have an order come in but it's not showing where's that gone Right, it's showing now, and it's Laurel. Hi, Laurel. You've bought stuff from us before. Um, thank you so much. You've bought 40 Towers DVD that I picked up when I was down in Bristol with Carla. Uh, brand new, sealed, complete series one and two. Absolutely love that show. And some Super Mario figures. Um, yeah, both lots going to Laurel. Thank you very much. Um, so, Forty Towers is here. Yeah, my favourite sitcom of all time, and I don't think that's ever going to change. Pop that there. And then some... Where are they? Here. Little bag of Mario figures. There's a couple of these really cool tins as well. For a while they were doing, they may still make them, like sweets in tins, but they were all Mario themed, so that's like a little question mark block. There's also a mushroom tin in there, and a few vinyl figures. So, oh look at that, space, the final frontier. As always, I will find a video, I will pop it up here, so please watch this one if it looks interesting. Take care, and I'll see you soon. Bye.